Oh. No big deal, I'm just, uh, just in Hawaii. in Hawaii. What is this? What the fuck am I looking at? Guys, I've been a bad boy. Joe asked me before I came here to just, you know, turn the camera on, film some stuff, you know, while I'm here in Hawaii. Just make some content, but I gotta be honest, man. Hawaii is gorgeous and beautiful. And the last thing I wanted to do was be stuck looking at a camera screen and holding a camera at every location I went to. But now is the time where I can actually make something interesting. Something that I'd like to chronicle, something that I'd like to experience, and I'd like you to come along with me, and I'd like to have the, the memories of, is of course going to locations from one of my favorite television shows of all time. Right now, at this very moment, we have rented a car so that we could go to Lost locations, and that's what we're doing right now. And if you don't like the show Lost, or if you've never seen it, buckle up, baby, because you're not gonna give a goddamn care about what we're about to do. But if you love Lost, just like I do, or even just a little bit, buckle up, baby, because you're gonna love what we're about to do. location on the television show Lost. Uh, it's Dharmaville and uh, I don't want to say too much more for those of you that haven't seen the show but yeah let's let's check it out. This is a wonderful location. I'm very excited. Where Schremder tells Opal it's the end of the line. It's not real. This is crazy because I remember 
watching Lost for the first time, and when we got to the seasons where this stuff happens, I just remember it being such a powerful thing to me. I don't know why. It just... This series affected me in a, in a way that no other series really had. There's something magical about being on an actual island, on a real-life island, and the show took place on an island. Yeah, this is special. This means something to me. This means a lot to me. This is very special. I know it's stupid, but I love it. This is location number two on the uh, on this lost tour that we're about to take uh, down this path is uh, the the pathway to the original beach that the castaways crash landed on. I'm very excited about this. This is uh, this is very exciting. All right, this is uh, this is it. Seems treacherous, but it isn't. This is another lost location we're coming to. The secret pathway. This is it. So you look out this way, and you don't see any structures, you don't see any housing. And then you look out this way, and it's just absolute nothingness as far as you can see. It's perfect. together we're gonna die alone Ooh, live together or die alone Either live together or you die alone you live together or you die alone oh, yeah. guys I'm about to perform surgery on a dog just kidding we're about to take a tour on a on a raptor the third raptor well this one says raptor too Apparently things get very dusty on this tour, so I'm going to do very little filming probably because I don't want dirt on the lens. <laughs> yes! We are the superstars! <laughs> Look at the aspect ratio of this poster. What? 4, 8, 15, 16, 23, 42. What? 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 That was kind of the the last kind of lost thing that that we were gonna see on this tour, which uh, was pretty rad. Uh, it was awesome. <laughs> Thank you for. That's how I spent my summer vacation. Did I have a good time? Of course I did. 
When will I ever go back to this beautiful paradise wonderland called Hawaii? I love it. When will I ever return? I saw so many beautiful trees and people and indigenous plants and fruits and I had many vegetables. I ate a lot of vegetables the whole time I was there. Mostly vegetables is what I ate while I was in Hawaii. Will I ever be back to this paradise in the sand? Of course not. Why would I ever go back? I want and will not have time. But I'll never forget that when th when I was in there, well, and I got real burnt up, got some red leg. Oh, and what about Scary Joey? Well, that's a story for another time.